one of Robin's years, I, I played five different parts. I was in five different plays. Now, some of them started rehearsals early and some of them started rehearsals late on. So I wasn't always rehearsing five plays at the same time. But there was a time mid-season when I had five balls in the air at once. I cannot conceive of having five, five different characters running through me at the same time. Yes, you can. Of course you can. No, of course it you can. fries it's, my brain, my imagination, and no. it's a brick wall. No, it doesn't. It, one helps the other. That's why working in repertory is so oh, uh, is so okay, astonishing. Exactly. So you're working on one, and this actor's thing is it's still going, and it just suddenly goes sink over to another one, and you realize. I used to realize, uh, walking down the stairs from the rehearsal hall onto the stage, something would occur to me that had happened on stage, in the play that I was rehearsing on stage the rehearsal time before that had been stirred up by the rehearsal from a different play that I had just come from in the rehearsal hall. And going down the stairs, something would occur to me f pointing toward the rehearsal that I was going to that had never occurred to me before. And it's just because your subconscious, if you let it, as you know, your subconscious does a great deal of the work for you, and your subconscious is so much smarter than you are. <laughs> and so it does the work if you let it. And if you're doing two plays at once, or three plays at once, or even five plays at once, you don't have the time to worry each part into the ground. So somehow it gets put in there, and then your subconscious mind deals with a great deal of it. Of course, you still have to do your work. You still have to do your research. You still have to learn the lines. You still have to do all those front brain things or those left brain things or whatever, whichever part of the brain it is that, that works on it. But the subconscious takes care of the other stuff, the stuff that you can't possibly think up. 